Hello, my name is Jalen Douglas. I'm the current president of the National Panhellenic Council at Texas State University. As president, I oversee both fraternities and sororities. NPAC was founded on May 10th, 1930 at Howard University in Washington, D.C. Each of the nine chapters evolved during a period of time where African Americans were denied essential rights and privileges afforded to others. Racial isolation on predominantly white campuses and social barriers of class on all campuses create a need for African Americans to align themselves with other individuals sharing common goals and ideals. The purpose of NPC is to foster cooperative actions of its members in dealing with matters of mutual concern. To this end, NPC promotes the well-being of its affiliate fraternities and sororities, facilitates the establishment and development of local councils of NPC, and provides leadership training for its constituents. The primary purpose and focus of NPC remains as focusing on community awareness and action through educational, economic, and cultural service activities. A few of the many objectives are to one, assist in establishing and facilitating local councils on campuses and within communities wherein chapters of these fraternity and sororities are located. Two, serve as the communication link between these constituent fraternities and sororities, especially in matters such as scheduling workshops and national meetings. Three, conduct periodic workshops or training sessions with the officers of the local councils to ensure a clear understanding of common operation procedures. Four, conduct an NPAC national convention slash undergraduate leadership conference of the active membership, officers and delegates of the National Panhellenic Council and the constituent local councils. Five, work cooperatively with and contribute to other community groups. These include agencies such as the National Black Leadership Roundtable, National Coalition of Black Voter Participation, the NAACP, the National Urban League, the National Council of Negro Women, and the United Negro College Fund. Six, provide unity and economic empowerment through and by the member organizations. And lastly, but not least, seven, to perform such other coordinating functions as set forth within the Constitution and bylaws of the National Panhellenic Council or determined by the Executive Board of the NPAC. So now I'm going to talk a little bit about our intake process. So first and foremost, Greek membership goes beyond your collegiate experience. This is a lifetime commitment. The individual is expected to align with the graduate slash alumni chapter following graduation with, from college with the expectation that you <laughs> would re attend regular chapter meetings, regional conferences, national conventions, and take active part in matters concerning and affecting the community which you live in. Recruitment intake differentiates based on the individual chapter. The specific new member intake process, information, and financial information, again, financial information, vary upon individual chapters for, as well. For more information, I would contact your specific chapter that you are interested in, or find the information on the NPAC website or the specific chapter's website as well. Now I'll give information about the day-to-day -day life of an individual member in our council. So basically, if you're in our shoes, it's no different from being somebody else that's not in our council. We are in other on-campus organizations, we go to class, we are also in other meetings. We have our own meetings, our council meetings, our chapter meetings. We throw educational events, we throw social events, but most importantly, we do volunteer work. Each semester, we have a new members retreat, and we also participate in other workshops through fraternity and sorority life. So as an NPAC member, we interact through forums, meetings, and other mediums while engaging in cooperative programming and initiatives through various activities and functions. So for more information about NPAC, you can either go to the NPAC website, email the NPAC website, or you can follow Texas State NPAC at Instagram. It'll be at TX State NPAC or our Twitter page, which will be TX State NPAC. Or you can contact each individual chapter through web page or social medias. And always feel free to come to our events and contact us in person. Thank you for watching.